all the stars. Look at the central column. I had no idea it was concealing something like this. Let's get a closer look. This is the Key Rights Gallery, but not as I remember it. Now I see why we never managed to unlock the gates. Their power comes from this arcane helix. Amazing. With the helix exposed, these gates can finally reopen. Perhaps not all of them at first, but enough to reach most of Tamriel. The question for you, I suppose, is where to first? I can walk through any of these gates. Let's do it here. Fuck it. Eh. Wait, what? That's not how it works. That was an that kind of match, I have to talk to this bitch. Can you? Can you believe? Oh wait, whoa, whoa, I clicked that way. The key rights. The key rights gallery opened doors to every corner of Tamriel. Places I suspect that desperately need a hero's aid. This choice. So, have you chosen yes. where to go? What region of the world strikes your fancy? No. Perhaps. Magica for sure. Wait. Actually. Yeah, I should find this stamina again. Bought that first skill still. Pretty sure I can't purchase the other skills, right? Oh. How many skill points do I have? Oh, one left. Choice. Yippee! This portal leads to oh. Wardenfell. 
fascinating, given that the Dark Elves only recently opened it to outsiders. Our spies indicate there might be something wrong with the Dunmer's God King, Vivek. Anything capable of that is a threat to everyone. Fuck it. It is written. My Varden <clears throat> fell. I'm not exactly sure. Outlander, by order of the death, I need, I suspect, I need to check in by the time we, it was just ever since here and ever since I was here and in all. Forgive me, Lord Canon Levoul. He remained behind after we retreated from the tomb. I know he wants to get back inside and ask Lord Vivek's questions, but there's no way he can get past the Daedra or ask the questions on his own. May the three grant him wisdom. Tarza, what's wrong? Someone help! Why, the three? First a wounded armager, now this! By dawn and dusk, evil creeps through the shadows of my beloved Vardenfell. But an outlander arrives to aid my people, just as I have foreseen. Those lads, what do they mean? What, what happened? Merciful Azura, the mother soul spoke through you. It's a miracle! Lord Vivek, the Daedric Prince Azura possessed that woman and spoke through her. I've heard of such occurrences, of course, but to witness such an event. She said evil creeps through the land. I wonder if it has anything to do with what we saw at the tomb. We sought guidance in a matter that concerns Lord Vivek. I received specific questions to ask while Levul concentrated on summoning his ancestor. The Daedra ruined those plans when they fell upon Urnsi and we were forced to flee. Vile creatures from oblivion! You hear about an odd ghost or a nest of vampires, but never Daedra! Please. If they're still there, they'll rip Canon Levul apart. He's definitely not a warrior. Just look at what they did to the buoyant armager. 
The buoyant armagers comprise one of the military orders of the Tribunal Temple. They seek to emulate Lord Vivek's deeds through actions and words. Poor Urnsi. Those monsters went straight for her. Her blood flowed like lava from Red Mountain. Where are you from? Children learn of Red Mountain before they even taste Flynn. The mountain sits at the center of Vardenfell, periodically rumbling like a sleeping Nyx shaking its leg. Lately, however, it seems to be waking from its long slumber. Azura is the cruel but wise Daedric Prince of Dawn and Dusk. She's one of the good Daedra, for what that's worth. But for her to speak through an innocent means something terrible is about to happen. Why else would she dare Lord Vivek's wrath? What do they teach you where you come from? Lord Vivek's a living god! Azura is merely the anticipation of Sothasil. Vivek stands as the present and the future, while Azura clearly represents Vardenfell's past. So no, they don't get along. Bring it, bitch. Bring it. I'm not doing that if I'm doing that, because I know this will fuck up my stomach. Bah! Hey, bitch. Oh, Nervous? What? Me? Asbury. Ha! What door did you make go this through? one laugh? Holly door? Is oh, just, uh, Vardenfall. Just horrible. The one on the, the, one the one on, on the very right. And stole his crops. Uh -oh. Alin's year okay. is just a simple farmer, you uh, see. Ah, you didn't want to go they through that one? Me <laughs> a starving pauper. Uh, very right? Yeah, the very you right. Help? Oh, bless you. This one planted his crops okay. in a cavern nearby. But I just wanted to make sure. But my notes and poison bro, the water. game looks so much Without better now. Irrigation, the yeah, it does. Will and it runs a lot better. It pays Hell yeah. To Here, hold on. I'm going to do the one chip challenge. These bandits must not prosper. You are a true hero, Walker. A brave and noble warrior. Falura and I are forever in your debt. Hmm? I am sorry. This one is a nervous wreck. Halingir is growing a rare Kajiti herb. Very delicate and very desirable. Good for seasoning fish and soothing the humors. Satisfied? Do not worry, Walker. You can depend on Halingir. Falure is this one's loyal farmhand. She is not very bright, and she is very lazy. Always scribbling notes and asking silly questions. But I keep her on anyway. Hallinger always does right by his friends. I could, but this one likes Falora. Plus, she probably knows too much. Oh, uh, she knows too much about my farming practices. Yes, Hallinger has many secret farming tricks. Like using fish heads and guar dung for fertilizer. But this one has already said too much, yes? Hmm? Sorry, I was just... Uh... Hey! You and I have the same belt buckle! What are the chances, huh? I am sorry. This one is a nervous wreck. Halingir is growing a rare Kajiti herb. Very delicate and very desirable. Good for seasoning fish and soothing the humors. Satisfied? Do not worry, Walker. You can depend on Hallingir. 
Falore is this one's loyal farmhand. She is not very bright, and she is very lazy. Always scribbling notes and asking silly questions. But I keep her on anyway. Hallinger always does right by his friends. I could, but this one likes Falora. Plus, she probably knows too much. Oh, uh, she knows too much about my farming practices, yes. Hallinger has many secret farming tricks, like using fish heads and guar dung for fertilizer. But this one has already said too much, yes? Hmm? Sorry, I was just... Uh... Hey! You and I have the same belt buckle! What are the chances, huh? I am sorry. This one is a nervous wreck. Hallinger is growing a rare Kajiti herb. 